Welcome back. This is Pam on Miss Piggy's Quilt on the YouTube. Uh, welcome back to my sewing room. Um, here is my quilt. Uh, I got the white all done. And all I got to do is flip it around and maybe put the backing on there and put the strings down here at the bottom and it might be also done. Unless I decide to put a border. I'm not sure. So keep watching out for the video on the next one. So I want to show you something really quick. Hi, Scooter. There's my dog Scooter down there on the floor. He's watching Mommy, ain't ya? You watching Mommy shaking your tail? Okay, over here, I went to Dollar Tree. Uh, yesterday, when I went shopping with my mom and my daughter, uh, I got me two of these little uh, black little trays. They got dividers in them. Uh, I put my thread here and my, some buttons and some uh, pins. And uh, I did the other one also uh, with the pin, uh, the needle there, and I want to put some rubber bands in there. There's only a dollar. So I got them. And they're nice to sort your buttons. Uh, so when I do my sewing, then I can just grab a button out there, and it's faster than doing it in my jar. And also, I got some uh, material my mom and give me yesterday. Well, I kept telling you guys on the video that before I like to get something to wrap my fabric in and to store it on so I got a box yesterday uh, my uh, it's a five shelf bookcase and they got different sizes at Walmart this was like twenty seven dollars my my grandbaby went with me yesterday also and um, she uh, we took our daughter home and then we went back and I got my grandbaby and my mom and me went shopping again so we went and uh, got this bookcase at Walmart, and it was $27, and I got it, and it has, holds uh, five shelves. My uh, husband is going to put it together. Uh, we're going to store it over here in this corner between the cutting table and my sewing desk. It's going to go right between this. So I didn't want it too wide. They had like white and brown and black. So um, I think they had black. Uh, yeah, they did. They had black and I decided to get a brown to match my desk to be more better. So I got that and we're going to take the hardboard, measure it between these blocks when he gets it together and we're going to wrap our fabric around it and put and store my fabric on it. So that's that. Uh, keep watching out for that. And I got some little rhinestones. I got in my craft room also. I want to get another little shelves in there to put my flowers on and my ribbons to store my ribbons on. So keep watching out on the craft room and the sewing room and see what I'm coming up with next. And up on the wall up here, I do want to get a few more decorations. I like to find me a button clock. So if anybody's got any designs that they would give me over the email, please do. And uh, some kind of designs on my quilts, I appreciate it. I love to get designs and hear things from people and put it in my book. So I appreciate everybody stopping by. My name is Pam. and. I'll see you next time when I get this put together. You can see it on the video and my quilt. So I'll see you next time. Bye.